All right, this is the brake line off of a, a 95 Chevrolet. And this is actually the whole line. I've cut it up. I've cut it up. But I don't think you'll be able to see that there. But, but this is a, a little hole in this thing. You would think that this line would, would this big line would have a big a hole through the center, and, but it don't. But, but And it took me a little while to figure this out, but, but I cut a piece of this line off. And uh, if you watch, I can blow through that line. And, okay, now here's the whole line. I tried to cut it up to see, gonna show you what was inside of it, but it's, it ain't working out too good. But but I'm gonna try to blow through this and now I can't I can't blow nothing through it and and like I say it took me a little while to figure this out but uh, you know you, you wouldn't think the brake line would would make brake stick okay now when you mash the brakes it's under power you know with the booster and everything and it's got a hellacious tremendous amount of power pushing in. But then but then it has to uh but then when you let off the brake, a little bit of the brake fluid has to back up through this and uh for the brakes to release. But if this is stopped up, uh it'll it'll keep the fluid from from backing back up enough to a little bit to keep your brakes from sticking. But uh, anyway, if you if you got that problem, there's a pretty good chance that this right here is what will solve it. I, I actually uh, put a new caliper on mine first, and it's still doing exactly the same thing. And then I done this right here, and it's perfect now. All right, everybody, thanks for watching.